Prince George, Charlotte and Louis at risk of being dragged into royal feud with Sussexes. The continual dragging up of the rift between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal family may have negative repercussions for Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis are at risk of continuing the royal family feud into the next generation, thanks to Ahmed Scobie's new book Endgame, Inside the Royal Family and the Monarchy's Fight for Survival. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. His latest release, due to be published this Tuesday November 28, promises to lift the lid on the current crisis engulfing the British monarchy, but royal experts believe it will ultimately have a damaging effect on the royal children. The Wales children, aged 10, 8 and 5 respectively, see very little of their American cousins, Prince Archie, 4, and 2-year-old Princess Lilibet, however there is concern that Mr. Scobie's book will hardly encourage good relations between them in the future. Royal author Margaret Holder said, My concern isn't that Scobie will bring down the monarchy, as he simply hasn't got the power, but this repeated pattern of defending Harry and Meghan's corner to please their supporters might spill over into the next generation of young royals with the Sussex children at odds with their Wales cousins. She continued, I don't dispute his right to present the case for a modernized monarchy, on that I agree with him, but I do regret his quoted savaging of William and Catherine. Omid Scobie has been dubbed the unofficial biographer of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, making it unlikely the children will feel particularly warm towards them if the book is so vicious about their parents. Di Davis, ex-head of Royal Protection for the Met Police, agreed with Ms. Holder, saying, this is clearly a hatchet job. This sounds like an attempt to drive a wedge between the King and William. In spite of admitting to indirectly helping Mr. Scobie Cawther the 2020 book Finding Freedom, the Sussexes have apparently tried to distance themselves from his latest release. Mr. Scobie stated in response to the claims, Endgame is about the current state of the British royal family. It's not Harry and Meghan's book, I'm not Meg's pal, the Sussexes have nothing to do with it, their story is a small part of a much bigger one. Mrs. Holder said, even the catchy title harks back to a remark made in 2001 by the late Anthony Holden about Diana's panorama, interview, to the authors of Diana, Story of a Princess. Commenting on Tory Minister Nicholas Soames's attack on Diana, Holden said, I thought that this was really the endgame now. Scobie clearly thinks it is. Prince William is portrayed particularly unfavorably in Endgame, as the author claims that the future king is desperate to succeed his father and used his media contacts to make Harry seem emotionally fragile. Mr. Scobie said William is known for his fiery temper, saying, when something doesn't suit him, his anger immediately escalates. He wants the job done, and he has no problem with casualties along the way. The Prince of Wales is eager to ascend the throne. A real impatience is created around him. He adds that the Princess of Wales lacks backbone, and is terrified to do anything more than grinning photo opportunities.